Hello there, welcome back to the channel. I'm Adam Lewis, you're watching Adam Lewis TV. AMC stock, the short squeeze, when's it gonna happen? Think it's happening this month. Everything seems to be pointing in that direction. Let's take a look at a little bit more. Come on in. So here we are on Sunday. By the way, I hope you had a great weekend. I hope this new year is treating you and your family wonderfully. Uh, hope you're safe, hope you're healthy. Um, let me start by saying I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I know you hear this, you hear this all the time, but you know, gotta say it for those uh, legality purposes. Not a financial advisor, not financial advice. Entertainment purposes only this video. Um, but having said that, you know, I, I listened to Al from Boston today and he kind of strengthened my resolve in my original thoughts. You know, if you've been following this channel and if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe to the channel with notifications. You'll be glad you did. But back in April, May, when this channel started, um, you know, my original resolve was like, hold, hold, hold till, you know, $100,000 a share. And I'm still there. Let's not get it twisted. If you've been following me, you know, you know that I'm one of them high number kind of guys because mathematically we know it can get there. However, on, you know, siding on the cause, you know, on the side of like, you know, caution, you know, you got to be careful with your money. You, you got to at least, you know, I got to at least make sure that I recoup my initial investment. Right. And that means brackets for me. For me, that means brackets. I am strongly holding strongly holding to those $50,000 per share, $100,000 per share numbers, and maybe even more than that. Again, listening to Al today, he had a, a like a, a live session that he did. You might've seen it. If not, go check him out. But those are real numbers. Those are real numbers that we can see. Now, I think, and, and, and most, most of us here think, most of us in the YouTube community rather, us apes, we think we think January is going to be the day, the, the month that this thing starts popping. And it could go into February. It could it could last a, a, a few days, a few weeks if they do trade halts, which we know they're probably going to end up doing. It could go a month once it starts squeezing. But the numbers will be there as long as we hold. Um, and, and that's the bottom line. Nothing's really changed in that philosophy, right? We, we we're going to hold our position until we see numbers that we're going to sell till we bleed them out, right? That's how this works. Uh, and again, not financial advice. Your number's your number, pick a number and stay with it. You know, if you're, if you're going to sell it in the hundreds, sell in the hundreds, it'll give us more time to collect bigger dollars. You know what I mean? But why do that? Cause why? I don't want to kick myself in the ass when this is all over and have sold in the hundreds or thousands and realize that, hey, I could have made millions because I held till $50,000, $100,000 a share. Now, I'm not sitting on thousands of shares like a lot of people or some people, maybe you. If you're sitting on that amount of shares, you might want to bracket too. I, I don't know. Again, not financial advice, but you might want to... Make sure you get yours, you know, get your money, clear your slate and, and then ride the rest up because we know it's going to hit those numbers. I mean, come on, uh, the DTCC, they're an insurance. Look, these are, are, are situations and institutions put in place for a reason. And we've got 4 million eyeballs throughout the entire world on this play, also on GameStop, sundial down the road, naked. Uh, you know, uh, progenity, all sorts of shorted stock. The eyeballs are on this. We're not going anywhere. The government, they're not going to let this thing not play out. They're going to let this play out and it's going to squeeze. And that's it. That's my opinion. That's my humble opinion. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. But majority of my shares, $50,000, $100,000 per share before I even think about selling those. The majority of them. I will shut down a few, you know, just to make sure kind of thing, an insurance policy kind of thing. But I probably don't even have to do that because like I said, listen to Alfred Boston. These are smart guys, man. These are smart minds that 
are in the know, you know? Um, and I don't think we're gonna be left holding the bag with that. I don't think so at all. I think we're, we're, we're in a good spot. And again, nothing's changed. Hold, remember? Hold, hold, hold. What do you gotta do? Hold. It costs you nothing to hold. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. I'll do another video tomorrow. I'm pretty strong in my opinion that this thing's gonna reach sick numbers, uh, especially if they do trade halts. You're gonna come back. This will probably start, as Al said, in after hours trading sometime, hopefully this month. We'll start seeing like, you know, 60, 70, 80, 100, and then it's gonna go. It's gonna go, and there's no stopping it. Really, hedge funds start folding, liquidations of long positions. There's so much money out there. This thing's gonna pop like Pop Rocks, baby. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. Smash that like button. Come on now, help a brother out. We'll see you soon, we'll talk to you soon. Have a great day, God bless.